back to my channel i know it's been literally so so long since i've done like a sit down video but you know the semester started life happened and it's like i've recorded videos but it's like i'll try to edit them and i'm like uh this is trash like let me delete this so i could have added more content but then on top of me being lazy i didn't like the videos that i did record so then here we are now uploading a sit down video like at the end of march hopefully this comes out by the end of march but yeah um today's video i want to do a hygiene routine uh, and basically like kind of on tips and tricks that i do to smell good throughout the day and yeah so without further ado i'm gonna show you guys what's since i live um on campus at my university i well i live on a campus apartment so i don't I only share a bathroom with one other person, but I don't know, like ever since freshman year, I've had a shower bag and I've just grown accustomed to having my shower bag with me. Cause it's like, I don't have all my stuff with me, period. And I know where all my stuff is at all times. You know what I mean? So I just, I still have my shower bag, even though I don't really need to no more, but I still do. So I'm gonna show you guys like the stuff that I keep in my shower bag. Okay guys, so here's my shower bag. You guys can see it. I have a lot of stuff in, but I don't use everything in here every day. Um, but I do take two showers a day. Like every morning when I wake up, I take a shower. And then when I'm about to go to bed, I'm take a shower. Or if I'm going out that night, then I'll take a shower before I go out. So then I, when I come back, I just take my makeup off and crash and take a shower in the morning. <laughs> so that's first. But, um, okay. So... I use this African black soap. I got it from Walmart, but you can pretty much get it anywhere. I know like, well, from different brands, but I know like even a vitamin shop, that store, they even sell African black soap and like Whole Foods, Target, anywhere that you can get it anywhere. I just got this at Walmart for $6. Let me show you guys what the um, bar looks like. But let me tell you guys, I bought this in August and it is still just as huge. Well, it has a big dent in it because I've been using it since August, like literally twice a day since August. But it's, you get the point. It's still huge. Like, you know, like, look. And it's still in the plastic. I just lift the plastic up to take like a piece because you really don't need that much. Like you, like, you really can just rip out a piece and then wash your face with it. Or if you want to wash your skin with it or whatever, I feel like... um even though I still put like antiseptic and stuff on my to clear my piercing, it helps to clean your piercing and it helps with um keeping my face afloat as well. Even though um I mainly use my Fenty skin to um clear up the acne. Like I had really bad acne a couple months ago because I had a breakout due to using biotin. If you're acne prone, don't use biotin. It's just it's not a smart idea. <laughs> it took me like a month and a half to get rid of that acne like oh my gosh like i was so glad my boyfriend bought the fenty skin thing because that helps so much but the african skin also helps so much like they both together it helped my skin like y'all see how y'all see how clear my skin is okay. so as i use the african black soap and this other i switch between soaps um there's three soaps that i mainly use like for my actual body it'll either be the dove bar soap or it will be the um, tone, but they don't really sell tone anymore. Like I always got it at Walmart, but they don't really have them at Walmart no more. So I think they discontinued that bar soap or whatever, but it's that. And then this bar soap I got from the hair store. I forgot what it's called, but my mom, she always used it. So I always use it. I think they have them at some like the um, Walmarts, but like more in like the ghetto locations. <laughs> I don't really see them at like the upscale located Walmarts, but like those are the three soaps I use. And like if I get like a new tattoo or something um, that I have to use like antibacterial soap, then I'm gonna use Dial Bar Soap. For those are the soaps that I use, I use Bar Soap and I also use, um, what's it called? I also use <laughs> body wash. I don't know why that took me so long to remember. Let me show you guys the body wash that I use. So I use this body wash from Bath and Body Works. It's the Rose Vanilla Love one. I really did not even really ever use the aromatherapy like stuff from Bath and Body Works before, but my boyfriend had bought it for me for Valentine's Day, like like basically all of it. But the this smells so good. Like I I literally transitioned this into my main like lotion scent because I've been trying to 
Like I told y'all in my fragrance video, I've been trying to wean off of um, Bath & Body Works as like a perfume, like as my main scent and trying to get into more like, I guess you could say more mature scents. So as y'all will see, I have like a designer perfume video that will, it will come up eventually. I just need to grow my collection a little bit more, but it's growing. Okay. <laughs> the, the, but the body wash just smells so good as well as the lotion. Like they had an aromatherapy sale the other day. After after he put me onto this, I had to buy like, I bought like five more lotions and then I bought like two more of the body washes. Grandma stock up because they smell so good. And it's like, that's why I love using the body wash and the lotion together, let me show you. So I like to use the lotion that looks like this. This is like my second bottle and I have like four more. <laughs> but um yeah it smells so good so like i really transitioned this into my main scent he, um before this like before he put me onto this i usually wore like um like the cherry blossom scent from jerkins i think it is it's but it's like a really generic um lotion but that's it smells good it's just super generic so it's like um the way i had it set up was i would try to finish out the bath and body works like lotions that i had before um and just use those instead so i can or like re-gift them or something if i okay i had i had a lot okay I, it's, it's getting there but i had a lot that i never opened or never used that i was just trying to grow out of it so i when you put me onto this so i'm like i think this is really when it comes to bath and body works and like their body products like to smell good on, within yourself i think this is the only scent i'm gonna do and then i'm gonna wear my um designer perfumes on top of it so yeah that's really what i've been doing lately and it smells so freaking good like, I love taking a shower and getting out the shower just so I can... No, I love getting in the shower to use the body wash. And I love getting in the shower to use... And get out of the shower to use the freaking body lotion. Like, it smells so freaking good. Like, oh my gosh. I don't, I don't know. But, yeah. So, that's basically what I do. I use my bar soap. Well, I have my wash cloth and I use my bar soap. Uh, right now, I have... What is it? I have the... um. The bar soap I was talking about from the beauty supply store. So I have that and then I, I put that on my wash rag and then I put my body wash in my wash rag and then I wash up. Do that twice a day. <laughs> so at the end of the day, uh, you come out the shower, you smell like the body wash, but you also know you cleaned up for real because you had a bar soap. I know some people use one or the other. I don't know. I, I never use one or the other. I have to have both. Like if I only have bar soap, I'm going to go out and buy a body wash so I, that's why i like to stock up because i want to at least have something so like if i know i'm running low then i can go back to the store and get it but i i rarely ever run out of soap <laughs> like i have to have soap when i get out the shower so the deodorant that i use when i get out of the shower well when i get out of the shower i literally go straight to like moisturizing like i put on my lotion then i put on my um fenty skincare and stuff so basically as you guys can see in my fenty skincare review in the mornings i'll put on my fat boy toner and then i'll put on the moisturizer spf especially if i know i'm like actually leaving my dorm that day so i um those are two things i always have in the morning and then um at night like if i'm coming back from somewhere i have to wash off my makeup i use my cleanser let me show you guys so this is what i use in the morning along with this so these two <laughs> if you guys can see them and then this is what i was saying that i use the cleanser at night like when i'm washing my makeup off and then i'm about to go into the shower and then when i come out of the shower at night i use the overnight cream which looks like this and it looks like this <laughs> So yeah, those are what I use uh, on my skin. And then I use, again, the lotion. So then I also like, I really always like, if you see me out, you're never gonna see me ashy. It's just, it's it doesn't happen. I'm not, a, it's not gonna happen. Everybody, everybody that's close to me that knows this. I don't get ashy, girl. I wear, every time I get out of the shower, along with me putting on my lotion, I moisturize my feet and my legs with Vaseline. Okay, uh, my friends say I say Vaseline beard. It's just Vaseline. I don't care. <laughs> but I I use that like 
um especially on my feet so I, it keeps my feet soft as well and i put lotion over it and it keeps the scent of the lotion because the vaseline is thick so it keeps the scent of the lotion as well within it so you're still gonna smell the rose vanilla on my feet as well like even if i'm wearing sneakers you're still gonna smell a hint of it you know what i'm saying because the vaseline is already moisturizing my feet as well with the lotion and the vaseline stick and it stays on all day so I do that, I do all that, and then the deodorant that I use is the Suave 24 hour protection one. I I prefer like the roller, I think that's what they're called, like the roller, y'all see what I'm saying, like the roller deodorants, like I prefer that way more than I do like um the stick ones, like I don't, I hate stick deodorants, I feel like they always leave like a residue, I feel like with the roller ones, they... They just absorb into your skin or whatever like it's not like it stays there but it's also like it's clear it's compared to like the stick ones where it's, it's just white residue that can get on your shirt and all that other stuff and this just feels better too so and this scent i have always used it since i was like in middle school and it smells super good so my mom put me onto this and i still wear it so i use that and then i seal it in with baby powder this one i need to get a new one but I don't know, my friends would tell me that it's bad to use baby powder under your armpits. Apparently, it's been linked to like giving cancer to people and stuff, but I still use it. I just, I gotta smell fresh. And this, like, even if I'm going to bed, I still do all of this before I go to bed. Like, this is just me coming out the shower. So sometimes in the morning, I try to use the scrub in the morning. It's the Jason Apricot Scrubby, and I got it at Walmart. This is like pretty much empty um but it's like a brightening a brightening scrub so it brightens your face up as well so use it as a scrub and then i put the african black soap on afterwards but even if i didn't have that i feel like the african black soap would still have my skin pretty much set you know what i'm saying like i feel like it just would sometimes when i'm lazy like y'all know how i said earlier that if i'm like if i know i'm going out that night i'll take a shower before i go out and when i come back like, because I know, like, if I'm getting drunk or something, when I come back, I'm, if I have enough sense to take off my makeup, I'm going to take off my makeup, and then I'm going to hit the hay. You know what I'm saying? So, I like to use either the Fenty cleanser that I was showing you guys, or this Garnier micellar water. I use this with cotton pads as well, and it gets the job done. It's just the Fenty one is more, like... I really feel like my skin is clear like i really feel like my skin is cleaned up with the fenty one but with the micellar one it's like i know when i wake up in the morning i gotta make sure i wash my face for real because i feel like that's like a halfway type of thing you know because it's just micellar water but it it's still like up to the surface level like um appearance wise you still don't really see the makeup like that after you take it off with micellar water so it still gets the job done it's just i feel like with the fenty thing it gets it at a lower um like level within the skin and not just the surface level so that's what i use that for so i don't know i don't like um i don't like shaving um creams or whatever i feel like they are either too sticky i used to use um baby oil because someone said that um baby oil is great to shave with in the shower personally it's not i think that's the worst thing i've ever heard and i'm i can't believe i really tried it it really doesn't help at all it's just sticky and it and it's like the water doesn't help so i don't i don't advise that at all but what i have found is that like that's a regular schmegular body wash to shave like whether it's down there your armpits or your legs whatever a regular body wash like just putting it on there and i get my I get the basic ass razors from um walmart like it's nothing too special for razors it still gets the job done you know when a girl has enough money she gets waxed but the razors are for the other parts <laughs> but yeah i mean or just a simple body wash i've had this for a while it's basically from walmart you can get any basics one whatever you can use on your legs armpits down there bikini area wherever you want to shave with but that's what i really use for shaving i don't really use like a shaving cream or anything it still smells good it's just i don't know you guys on youtube have not really seen me with natural hair yet i mean i could insert like a clip or whatever because i don't really wear my natural hair out like that like i love protective styles because i don't like i'm lazy i don't like dealing with 
my natural hair all the time. Like the max I'll have it out for is like three or four days. And that's it, baby girl. I need, I need something. I need my edges laid. I need something. In. So, <laughs> but when I do, these are the shampoos and conditioners that I use. And they smell so, so good. It's the Olive Oil R-esque replenishing conditioner this one smells like lemon and this one smells like aloe vera it's a shampoo it smells so so good even back home i still have um mine that my mom uses but yeah they they work they get the job done and they smell super good so also what i like to do after i um pretty much put lotion on and vaseline and my um like skin care and stuff as soon as i do that before i really put clothes on i also like to put um perfume and stuff over like i like to put this is the burberry touch perfume i've been i i ain't had this for a month yet look how it smells so good like it smells so so good this these are what i have um right now my re-ups and stuff are coming in the mail i'm just I'm just doing this video before they come. Um, this is really not like a luxury scent. It's just, I like the packaging and it just smells good to me. People are like, I don't really like this scent. I like to mix it with other scents. Like I like to mix it with the Burberry Touch. I feel like with this with the um, heavier scent, it smells good together, you know? So I, I like that scent. And then this one, of course, my handy dandy. Um, Versace Crystal Noir. I low key forgot the name, but I'm getting the bigger bottle soon. I just been using my little vial up. Like, I want to use my vial up, but like, I'll spritz that like all over after. Like, this is after I shower and after I put like, after I moisturize and everything. Then I'll spritz perfume as well. And then I'll put my clothes on and then I'll spritz perfume in the same spots. I don't know why. It's just. It makes me feel better <laughs> even if i'm going to bed i still like to smell myself so i'm like oh okay i smell like burberry right now like you know so <laughs> that's what i basically do when it comes to um my hygiene routine what i would say i like to carry my perfumes with me this big lotion i can't really carry with me but i always have like hand lotion or something within my car or within my purse and you know same thing with the perfume i keep it within my car but i keep it within my purse i also use like um feminine wipes i think they're called like the wet wipes you use um to like go to the bathroom basically i keep them in my dorm bathroom i'm just really too lazy to get up i use the basic um generic one from walmart but it works too that also helps you to keep um fresh under there i would say but i mean they have like tiny ones so you can take them places with you just keep them in your purse and you don't have to use toilet paper but you can freshen yourself uh, yourself up down there you know what i'm saying so that's also a tip i would say but honestly i feel like girl take two showers a day like it's not that hard and i know like other people i won't i won't <laughs> like other people they'll take three showers a day you know it's not that hard just make sure you take a shower. Like that's that's key. Like I, if you're not doing that, I really can't help you after that. <laughs> but um, yeah, that's pretty much what I do. Literally every morning and every night. I, and then if I want to be extra, I add a face mask. And then of course I brush my teeth as well. Um, the toothpaste that I use is the charcoal. It's like a charcoal toothpaste. I'll like put a picture of it up there because I really don't feel like going out to the bathroom and go getting it right now. Y'all don't understand like I'm in pain and I'm lazy. Like it's just not a good combination. But yeah, <laughs> I use um that toothpaste. It's like a charcoal. It's what the Hello brand. That's what I think it's called. It's, um the brand is called Hello, and the toothpaste is charcoal and it gets the job done. It keeps your teeth white, really white pretty much what i do for my um shower routine I'm making sure you keep your face moisturized like literally keep everything moisturized there's no reason for you to be a grown woman and being ashy out here there's no reason so don't be ashy that's just law like don't be ashy mm -mm. 
I'll put something on. <laughs> but yeah, you guys, thank you guys so much for coming and watching my video. Please make sure to like, comment, and subscribe down below. And I'll probably leave like some of the um some of the links to the products as well. I'll probably leave down below. And check out my other videos as well. They're all in the description box. But thank you guys so much for watching my videos. And I will try to continue creating content because I have so many content ideas. Like I've said before, it's just me going out and actually liking the video that I recorded. So <laughs> thank you guys so much. Love you guys.